Cimetidine. Okay, when I say cimetidine, you're, you're thinking that dean, that D-I-N-E, that suffix a lot of times is going to refer to our histamine 2 antagonists, okay, our H2 receptor blockers, okay? So the trade name of this drug is Tagament. So you've probably seen Tagament over-the-counter, Tagament HD or whatever. This is cimetidine, okay? Now what it is, like I said, it's a histamine 2 H2 antagonist, okay? So what happens in our bodies, we have all these histamine receptors, okay? Within our stomach, we have these histamine 2 receptors. And what histamine does is histamine is released under stress, under under, and, and what it does, it goes and it binds to these things. And a lot of places in our bodies, it can cause inflammation. Now within our stomach, like I said, we have these H2 2 receptors, histamine 2 receptors, okay? So when histamine goes and binds to these H2 receptors within the stomach, what happens is those parietal cells within the stomach release acid, okay? They release HCl, and HCl, you know, is hydrochloric acid. That hydrogen portion of that is very acidic, okay? So that releases that acid into the stomach. Now, this can cause things like GERD, heartburn, Zollinger-Ellison syndrome, things like that. So that's the reason we're giving this, okay? We're giving this histamine 2 receptor blocker to block that receptor on those parietal cells to prevent the action of histamine uh, causing the parietal cells to release that acid, okay? Does that make sense? So again, treatment is it's going to be to treat duodenal ulcers, GERD, heartburn, zollinger ellison syndrome, prevention of GI bleeding in critical patients. So in our, in our critical patients, they're under so much stress, re- receiving so many types of medications and things like that, that we're going to give this to try to prevent it, okay? Again, its action, like I've already talked about, is to inhibit the action of histamine leading to the inhibition of gastric acid secretion. Therapeutic class is anti-ulcer. Pharmacologic class is H2 antagonist, like I said. So some of the things to keep in mind here is that these drugs can cause diarrhea and constipation, then cause headache, then cause fatigue, nausea, dry mouth, decrease in red blood cells. You're going to want to monitor for arrhythmias. They can cause agranulocytosis, aplastic anemia. We're going to want to monitor our CBC during therapy because it can decrease the RBCs, decrease the WBCs, decrease platelets. And now one really interesting thing about cimetidine specifically is that cimetidine can actually cross the blood-brain barrier. So because of that, what are we going to watch out for? We're going to watch out for confusion, okay? Cimetidine, independent of these other H2 antagonists, okay? Cimetidine can cross the blood-brain barrier. The others don't. And so with cimetidine specifically, or tagament, we're going to want to watch for confusion in our patient because it can have that effect, okay? So those are really some of the things we're going to want to watch out for this. Hopefully that all makes sense the way this kind of works. It's really a simple method of action when you think about it. In our body, we have these uh, these uh, parietal cells that have these histamine receptors. We want to block histamine from impacting those because when histamine does get those, it releases this gastric acid. Okay, so that's really what we're trying to prevent. And so some conditions where you'd want that, GERD, Zollinger Ellison, heartburn, things like that. All right, if you have any questions, be sure to let us know. This has been another episode of the MedMaster Podcast by NRSNG. To keep the learning going, head over to medmastercourse.com and use the coupon code PODCAST. MedMaster Course is the ultimate guide to nursing pharmacology with over 30 hours of video and audio lecture material. Never guess a med again, crush the NCLEX, and have confidence in your nursing pharmacology skills. Head over to medmastercourse.com. Use the coupon code PODCAST. We'll see you on the inside.